Welcome back YouTubers to another Flames of War hashtag TTH unboxing. Um, yes, let's dive into it. So here we have the SS Panzer Grenadier Company HQ armored late war period set and then we have the SS Scout Troop. Um, I gotta admit, love the box art. Um, no, you don't get a whole army in here, but it's well worth it for its price and value. Of course, you've got your bigger battle sets. Um, I will be doing more unboxings of each model set I come across and do, uh, whether it's Flames of War, Bolt Action, or just other military models or dioramas. Um, so let's look here. So yeah, both are late war. A uh, bit of history. Yes, this was the standard half-track, I believe, um, throughout the, the the German army, um, very efficient, very mobile, uh, well armoured, unless you came across another tank. But um, yeah, so you get one vehicle and two infantry teams. And the STK gives it 221 and 22 SS scout troops. So these these were very efficient. Um, these are actually, I'm, I'm actually buying these not just to play, but um, I'm currently busy with... A very large gaming board for these based on D-Day. So all the little sets I'm getting are going to go towards that. I had to get these because I don't have any sets currently with infantry and I had to use them to measure for the trenches. But anyway, let's dive into this. And we're back. Um, there we go. So that is all you get. I love the packaging. Very, very well packed. Um, actually quite tricky to open. Very keeps the stuff protected i'm not familiar i, th I think this is the resin material because it does feel quite heavy um it's very close to metal actually very very good quality that you get your your commanders infantry and then i noticed that the wheels the wheels and turrets for this are all metal or a type of metal Let's get it to focus. There we go. Yeah, very interesting. Your unit cards. The manuals are on the back of the boxes. And then um, with this one on a sprue, plastic infantry again. And then you get some squads over here with their bases and that. And then your unit cards. All in all, very... Um, I Yeah, I'm going to have fun building these. No great complaints with the packaging. Um... I believe this one you get those two and then the, the anti-tank version. Uh, there's no odd variants, I think. I'll have a look once I open these in more detail. Or I'll do another video once these are built, actually. Um, so, yeah, that's that's interesting. They're actually a decent size. Not, not bad at all. Um, so, yeah, those of you who follow Flames of War and follow my videos, there'll definitely be more. Um, I've got a few big sets coming down the pipe at some point, so there will be very good videos coming down as well and good um, more reviews in depth. Um, but as I said, um, those of you who follow my videos and play this game, give, give it a like and don't forget to subscribe. Um, and yeah, you will see in the next video, hopefully these will be finished, painted up and built, and I will definitely be doing another review on them. Anyways... Thanks for watching guys and as always leave a like and subscribe. Thanks.